Hello everybody, this is Chris from Tacking It Out, and today we're going to take a look at how to turn off Wi-Fi Sense in Windows 10 to protect your wireless network, and why this is something you might want to consider doing right away. Now for those of you that don't know, the chances are that if your computer is running Windows 10, you most likely are sharing your wireless connection with hundreds of people you don't even know, and you probably didn't even realize it's happening. And how they actually can do this? Well, simple. All any of them have to do is come near your home or office to gain access to your wireless network and which is then done by their Windows 10 device detecting a usable signal from your network and connecting automatically to your wireless network and the worst part about that is is they don't even need the password to do it. However, you are in luck though. If you're like me and you don't want hundreds of people to be able to connect to your Wi-Fi network automatically, you can turn off Wi-Fi Sense with ease. And here's how. So first what we want to do is you want to left click on the start button in the bottom left corner of your screen to open the Windows 10 start menu. From here what we want to do then is left click using your mouse on the settings button located right here in order to open the settings menu. Once the settings menu has opened, what you want to do is left click on network and internet. And now by default, it should already come up to the Wi-Fi option if it already. And if it doesn't, you would just simply click Wi-Fi to bring up that sub option of settings. And from here, what you want to do then is if you'll notice, you should see manage Wi-Fi settings and we want to left click here. And now, as you can see, mine is already off, but when you come up to this menu, these two options that say connect to suggested open hotspots and connect to networks shared by my contacts, you want to actually left click these, like so, I turn them on, but just for the purpose of this video, left click them like so, to turn them both off. Now, also another thing, you'll notice there's paid Wi-Fi services. I clicked this off as well beforehand, and you can do so too, obviously just to safeguard and keep more of your wireless network protected. And that's simply it. Once you have completed those three off buttons, you are done and good to go. And now you won't no longer have to worry about hundreds of people being able to connect to your wireless network for free and now protect your network with even greater security. I do hope you enjoyed this how-to and I'm glad that I could bring it to you today and have yourselves a wonderful day.